This video is on uh, horse aggression, uh, horses that charge and kick out as you're going to catch them. As you can see, I'm walking towards this horse. Try to put my hand out for him to stop. He walks right through me, and then he kicks out at me. I come down. So, um, what he does, he turns his butt towards you, kicks out, charges, as you'll see here in a minute. So I'm going to try to keep him moving around uh, as best as I can. There he charges my videographer, and it, she takes off, uh, which I don't blame her. So I'm going uh, to keep working him, and uh, keep him moving around pretty much, and uh, keep him away from me since he does want to kick. I'm going to stay out of kicking distance. Um, and I'm going to just keep working them, keep them moving around until I, you know, get in a place where, you know, I can easily walk up to them and, uh, pet them on the head, whatnot. But, you know, in this video, it takes a while. I probably spent over an hour with this horse, keeping them moving around. It's a very large pasture that he's in. And um, the best thing I can do is just keep him moving around, keep him out of a uh, kicking distance from me. Um, here he goes, he tries to kick me again. Um, you know, he, he just does not want to be caught. And it's not like he's that aggressive. He's just, you know, trying to play games with everybody. And if I don't want to be caught, I'll just start coming at you. Uh, he struck at the videographer a couple of times. And, um,. You know, it's just more of a game to him. So the best thing you can do is just keep him moving around uh, the pasture for a while until you uh, get into a spot to where you can um, have him stand still. You know, uh, exercising him is your best bet in the pasture uh, where he's kicking out or charging at you. Um, again, you know, he did charge at me. Uh, once in I threw the um, halter at him and you know he went the other way kicked out again so you just want to keep moving around uh, you know again exercise him uh, wear him out whatever you want to call it um, he's gonna learn real quick that that's not the answer for him to charge or kick out at you um, he's, he's, uh, from what I told, from what I'm told, he's, uh, pretty good under saddle. But, um, again, how I'm going to get him out of this, so anybody can go in and catch him, it's going to probably take me, you know, easily 30, 45 days of constantly going out there trying to catch him. And if he, you know, continues kicking out, charging, I'm going to definitely move him around and show him that it's not worth, you know, charging me or kicking out me it's a lot easier if I just put the halter on them and uh, take them into the arena and uh, work them a little bit um, but you know all this nonsense you know you can easily get hurt and you know you're going up against a thousand pound horse and uh, so again you just want to keep moving around and then as you're going to see I'm going to get them into place I'm going to walk in front of them I'm going to pet him on the head, then I'm going to go ahead and uh, put a halter on him, and uh, then he's caught. Again, it took him about 45 minutes, and now I'm going to take him into the round pen. All right, so he's, right, so he's got down out the pasture with Cayenne, who will charge and kick at you as you go to catch him, as he did several times. I just never let up on him, and I kept him moving until I got him to a place where he stood still. Then I went into, uh, then I stood in front of him, and then I was able to put the halter on him. But now we're gonna go ahead and sit here in the round pen with him and work him throughout the round pen so he learns when you go to catch him that he's not to uh, charge or kick out. It's just a game he learned how to play. He will bat him down or whatever the case may be. So we're just gonna go through basic round pen. I'm gonna first get him going to the left. Have him go to the left consistently. Then I'll do an outside turn because I don't want him charging at me and I'll have him go to the right. I'm gonna have him do an outside turn. I'm gonna be back far enough from him to where if he does kick out, you know, I'm, I'm Enough out of the way. If he does kick out, I'll go back to do another outside turn until he doesn't kick out, then we'll go to the right, then we'll start practicing inside turns as long as he doesn't charge. If he does charge or kick out, then we'll talk about what to do it after that. First thing you have to do is get your horse in a round pin. So we'll go out here, start putting pressure on him, and move him around so that he 
direction is to the left. Now we're going to go back into continuing doing the outside turns. If he does an outside turn, he can't charge into me. If I do an inside turn, I'm giving him a direct, uh, you know, direction into me where he can easily charge me. And there's no way I can get out of the way in time uh, before he, you know, gets to me. So it's outside turns, but stay out of the way of kicking distance. Then I'm going to go to um, inside turns here in a little bit. Um, where I step back and he does an inside turn. If I thought he was going to charge me, I'd immediately go back to an outside turn and continue that. Um, it's not that, you know, he's a mean horse or anything like that. He just has some, you know, really bad habits that have to be resolved. Um, you know, if a child was going to the pastor and he charges them, he's striking out at them like he did the videographer which she had to get out of the way um, you know things like that that's that's just not safe and the horse doesn't know his own power against us you know we, we weigh you know maybe you know 180 200 some people are you know uh, heavier but at any rate you know you're talking about a thousand pound horse that can do a lot of damage so it's a pretty bad habit with the horses you know aggressive or you know just playing around it, you know it's not acceptable and the horses have to learn that when we go to catch them that they can't do that or in any case they can't do that so this is a good way to take care of it I hope you enjoyed the video subscribe to my um, YouTube page to see new videos as they come out thank you